right, so today we're gonna be showing you how to bubble glaze with the items that we already put into your bag for you. So you have a little container of soap included, and then you can pick whatever colors um, from our rainbow glazes that we sent you to use to bubble glaze whatever piece you'd like. Um, you might have a mug or a bowl or a cup or something that you can add the bubbles to. So how you're gonna do this, we're gonna do one spoon full of our soap into the cup along with whatever color of glaze you would like. And again, it's gonna be about a spoonful, so this one's getting a little low, so I'm gonna actually use all the rest of it that's in here. And then the rest, we're gonna put in a bunch of water, so about three spoonfuls of water. You can start by just mixing that up. Try to get the glaze to really water down so that it's all one watery mixture. Once you have that, if you have an extra piece of Tupperware or something that you can put your cup or your um, pottery piece into, that's really helpful because then it'll hold some of the bubbles in so that they'll actually pop on top of your piece here. Um, for now, I'm just going to hold my uh, mixture over the top of my piece so that when I start blowing bubbles, it's going to fall onto my um, pottery. So. just kind of slowly let it start popping. You can blow on it a little bit if you want to get it to pop. And you can see we did some on the inside as well that have already started, that have already, you can see kind of how the bubbles pop in there. You can keep going with the same color or if you want, um, you can let this one dry and you can go back in with another color so you can do this mixture as many times as, if, if, as you like. If you get something that you're really not in love with, you can also take a wet sponge or a paper towel um, with water and just go um, through and you can scrub your pottery a little bit to get rid of anything that you don't like um, and just try it again. We hopefully packed you with plenty of materials so that you can experiment until you're happy with it. Don't worry about any um, spots that don't have any glaze on them. We can dip your entire piece in clear when it comes back to the studio. So just worry about the color and how it's looking for you and then we'll take care of the rest for you. Thanks.